Hey guys, welcome back to today's video. So today I thought I'd do a YouTube made me buy it type of video. So these are products that YouTube have made me buy and I've caved in and bought them. So I just had to erase some things on my memory card because it got full. I don't have the mass, the biggest memory cards in the world, so. And it still had the daily vlogs on, which or the weekly vlog on. So I just had to delete all that. So bear with me. Where was I? I was talking about the Elegant Touch Polish um, nails. Um, I really like these. They last really well. Um, and they fit my nails perfectly. And I feel like some fake nails, if you put them on, you can't and do things with them because they're so irritating. These ones aren't. I find that I'm able to type and do things I need to do around the house which I don't do a lot but like editing and things like that I can use these so I'm saving these for a definitely a rainy day um, and I'm not spending using them anytime soon because they're not cheap but I do love them something else that loads of youtubers were talking about was the impulse um, sprays now I absolutely love this one this is my favorite one um i rediscovered it the other day in my drawer something else that those youtubers were raving on about and they have recently just raved on about them um not that long ago with the oil based one but i have the uh, garnier micellar cleansing water um i just have the small one i also do have the big one but i got this one for free um because my mum bought something um and i love these why is my camera not focusing there we go i love these it takes my makeup off really quickly if i'm having a lazy evening and really cannot be bothered to take it off properly the next thing loads of youtubers are raving on about is um the like bath and body works mini hand gels now this is the black cherry Mer merlant one. Oh god um and i've had this for quite a long time now i'm actually going to link the website where you can get these from now it seems like a bit of a dodgy website but the reason i did order just one to see if like you could if it was worth doing it and it definitely is and they smell amazing and they are actually from the bath and body works so i don't know whether they ship them into their like a store and then get the money for it i don't know but that's how you can get yourself some bath and body works if you live in the uk so this is a lit lit or this is a little bit of an odd one um this is actually deodorant and flirt of force was talking about it and saying it was her favorite deodorant so i thought okay fine she keeps raving on about it. I'm bored of my deodorant because I was using Lynx and I got bored of it. So I started using this one. This is the Mitchum um, one. And I bought like the, not the spray one, but the um, cream one. Um, but I prefer sprays. And actually, I really like this one. It lasts really well and it lasts throughout the day. And these are actually really affordable. So, yes, I like those. Alex, I really, 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 really. There's something else that Fleur de Force was talking about which definitely isn't worth spending the money on I feel like um, because I find that they don't tend to stay on my nails very long is the um, sensational, sens no, sensational um, nail kit um, these I find they say they last up to two weeks but I definitely find that they don't and it's really not cheap um, so you get like you can buy different nail polishes which they say last up to two weeks I find that they last for about three days on my nails I don't know whether it's just how my nails are whether they last longer on other people's nails but I definitely find that this is not worth spending money on um, I will definitely use up what I've got but I definitely sort of wish I hadn't bought it um, or at least done a little bit more research into it before purchasing it was this curling wand now um, who was talking about it so Ella had been talking about tight curls and you will have seen how I do my curls I uploaded it on Monday um, so I'll link it in the description but if you want to go and check it out um, so this is the curling wand I used by Babalist and um, YouTube actually made me buy it because I wanted a curling wand which was quite affordable and under £20 so I just typed in Babalist and found this one and then saw that Emily Cannon had used it um, and she was doing a tutorial on it so I thought I'd pick up, pick my hands up on this and I actually really like it. Um, I curled my hair, when did I do it? Saturday and the curls are actually still in my hair and when I'm pre-filming some of these videos for this week it's actually Monday so they have lasted all of you 
this made me buy it. Uh, YouTube definitely made me buy this. It's the Tangle Teaser. Now my hair gets really tangly, as I was saying, um, in my what I got from my college in my college bag, and that's why I had a hairbrush. Um, but this is amazing when I've got really tangly hair. The only thing I don't like is you can't use it when you're drying your hair because it actually burns or melts the bristles on here um, because I did that with my old one and burned it, oops. Next thing I'm going to move on to is books. Now these are two books that YouTubers have got and then I'm going to talk about some other things. So the first one is Love Tanya. I absolutely love this book. I love her cookies in here um, so I might go and make them at some point. And this was really affordable. I think it was only £13. It was £13 but I don't think I paid that much for it. Um, and it's just a lifestyle type of video, how she got into YouTube, um, fashion, love, life, baking, happiness, growing up, skincare, makeup, there's so much in here and it's so worth buying this, like seriously, if you're that sort of girl who wants to know like life hacks, definitely get your hands on this book. And another one, if you want to know, life hacks is the Glamour gu Guide, Guide, <laughs> Glamour Guide, um, Glamour Guide by Fled Force. Uh, this has actually been signed by her. So this book has actually been signed by her, which is so cute. Um, I went to one of her meet and greets, but I absolutely love these. The illustrations in here is just amazing. Um, so yeah, that's another one that YouTube made me buy. And this was something that loads of people were raving on about. So I asked Santa Claus one year if I could get one. This is the Animal Kingdom um, adult colouring book, which I actually really enjoyed doing. I did one the other day. Where is it? I did this bird. It's so cute. Um, so yeah, I love doing these. Um, and they're really good if you have like health issues like I do. Um, I find it's really relaxing and calms me down. Um, so I definitely throughout 2017 want to start filling this in a little bit more. And someone's coming up the stairs. But finally not least, they still haven't come because there's been an issue with um, them sending out for some reason. They were sent out but they got lost. Um, is the Sug Life hoodies. Um, I sent them an email saying where are my hoodies <laughs> um, and um, they're actually going to resend them because they got lost in the post but I definitely would say um, that I'm happy that they got back to me so quickly and things like that so YouTube definitely made me buy the Sug Life hoodies um, but I can't physically show you so I'm going to insert a photo now um, so that you guys can see what they look like because for some reason a lot of people's got lost in the post so hopefully maybe they'll turn up but at this current moment, there is nowhere to be seen. So yeah, I need to end this video because I have a red flashing light and I need to take some thumbnail photos. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel and I will see you tomorrow for another video. Bye guys.